Hi, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Stephanie Adrian and I'm also a pharmacist. First of all, I want to apologize for my bad English because English is not my first language. My first language is actually Indonesian. So I'm definitely not fluent in English. So pardon me for my bad fluency, my bad pronunciation and things. I'm sorry. But today I'm going to do a video comparison between these products, Kills Powerful Strength Line Reducing Concentrate and Naturium Vitamin C Complex Serum. You may probably think that I'm crazy because this is in different price point, but I want to stress out the the active ingredients between this product so that you can understand the difference. Okay, first of all, Naturium Vitamin C Complex. I've actually talked about this product and I'm going to link the, this, the video in the description box. But they say that it is 22% of vitamin C. I've actually reached out to Naturium. Uh, what is the percentages of the vitamin C in their products? But they said that it is a proprietary to them, so they don't want to tell me. I've asked them three times and they don't they always say the same thing. It's a proprietary to them. So okay. So okay, that's that's fine for me. So and then I read the ingredients list, which contains of sodium ascorbic phosphate. L ascorbic acid and a lot of other fruit blend extracts such as pineapple which contains papain enzyme and also pineapple which contains bromelain, mango, kakadu plum which is really high in vitamin C and then burdekin plum and brown pine. So it is a combination of these fruit blend extracts and this vitamin C derivative and also L ascorbic acid to achieve this 22% of vitamin C serum. And then this one right here, it says 12.5% vitamin C. But this one, they, they really stated in the, in the box, it is 10.5% pure vitamin C ascorbic acid and 2% of ascorbyl glucoside. So this is what makes them difference. Okay, so the ingredients list of this product, like glycerin and also propane ideal, which is the, the substitute for propylene glycol, is really high up in the list. And then it has sodium ascorbic phosphate and then L ascorbic acid. So it is quite in the middle. So I think the L ascorbic acid of this product is very low. I think around 2%, 3% maximum. Because vitamin C, as uh, probably you may think, like, okay, this is formulated in the pH of 5.5 which is closer to your skin pH because it is also a gold encapsulated or things well you don't need to encapsulate anything if it's really low percentages okay you just can just straight up put it in the products and then it's going to be quite fine if you have this dominant sodium ascorbic phosphate in it so this product I think it is suitable for people who wants look who wants to go and find you know the gentler type of vitamin c or if you have sensitive skin or if you just want to get brightening ingredients and not the anti-aging properties because sodium ascorbyl phosphate is, is not well studied to have these anti-aging benefits so it's only for brightening and also it is quite quite nice actually because sodium ascorbyl phosphate there are some studies have been done that show that sodium ascorbyl phosphate is very beneficial to treat acne fulgaris, which is the normal type of acne you get. So if you have acne prone skin or if you have acne skin, you might want to go with this product because this one consists of really high sodium ascorbyl phosphate. Okay, so the texture of this product it is yellowish serum. And it is, it doesn't have fragrance, but from the fruit extract itself, it is, the smell is very strong. Okay, the fragrance is quite overwhelming to me. I can even smell the fragrance like from this distance and I can still see, I can still smell pineapple from this product. So it is, the smell is quite overwhelming for me because I definitely doesn't use a lot of fragrance product and this is very strong. So if you have sensitive skin, you might probably want to avoid this because it it may irritate your skin if you are sensitive to sort of fragrance or things because it is quite quite the smell is quite strong. And then we have this Kills Powerful Strength Line Reducing Concentrate, which contains 
10.5% of L ascorbic acid. Oh, I forgot to say the SAP. So, sodium ascorbic, oh, I've, I've talked about the SAP, right? Oh, yeah. And then I'm going to talk about the L ascorbic acid of this product. So, it contains 10.5% of L ascorbic acid, which is the active form of vitamin C, the most potent. The most well-studied vitamin C is L-ascorbic acids. So it contains 10.5% of L-ascorbic acid, which is quite high for a vitamin C. And vitamin C, L-ascorbic acid usually is stable at pH of 3.5 and lower. So it is definitely going to irritate your skin. But this product, I think this is also combined with ascorbyl glucosate, which is stable at around pH of 6 until 6.5. So it can raise up the pH a little bit to make the products not so irritating to your skin. And also, this kills vitamin C because it contains L ascorbic acid. So this is the perfect ingredient for you if you want to go for brightening properties or anti-aging to fight fine lines and wrinkles to help to even out your texture and to even out your skin tone, I think you might want to go with L-ascorbic acid types of serum. So I've used up these two products. I've used Naturium 2 until it is quite empty, you can see. Why? Because, okay, so my experience using this product is this one is not that good, I think. So I've a few of dark spots and after I use this, it doesn't fade my dark spot. Overall, it's going to brighten my skin up and it's, and it's okay, it's a little brightening and it is hydrating on my skin. This is very, quite hydrating for my skin. But overall, in terms of brightening and even out skin tone, I don't think it does a very good job at it. Also, in my country, Natrium is very expensive as well. So in USA, probably around $20, $22, $24. But in my country, I pay for this thing around $40. So I definitely have to use it up. I don't want to spend money. I, want, I don't want to waste money. So I definitely have to use it up uh, until it is completely empty. But I've also used this Kills product for quite some time. You can definitely see that I've used up the products. And... I think this is definitely stronger vitamin C. You can definitely see the improvement of my dark spot. You can definitely see that my dark spot is quite diminished already. So definitely this have done the job. It is very good. But this one, I, I do good. Not a lot of people probably like the texture because it is silicon based. Okay, so it is quite thick. Okay, it is quite thick. Not like this type of serum that is gel-like or quite runny it is silicon based so because it is silicon based the vitamin c itself doesn't oxidize that easily but this one it is already calm when i bought it it is already yellowish thin which i see in kills product is white so i think alongside from the transportation from usa to indonesia which is very far away it's 20 hours away so it definitely doesn't handle the temperature changes that well so it is quite oxidized but i can assure you that this really works on my skin and this really do doesn't really work on my skin so what i'm going to tell you is that not i'm going to this natrium or something but i've seen a lot of products that contains l ascorbic acid such as la roche posay and then has CeraVe, CeraVe already already launched their vitamin C and you have Inkelis and then you have the ordinary and a lot a lot of other brands that contains L ascorbic acid that you can find at your local store. So if you really want to go with this anti-aging brightening properties, please go to this type of products because because they listed the ingredients left of the concentration of the vitamin C. So you can definitely feel the vitamin C working for you. So you don't have to spend, you don't have to waste your money trying to find a lot of vitamin C serums that are going to work for you. If you can already see the L ascorbic version, then go for this one. For this anti-aging and this uh, anti-aging also this brightening properties. So don't waste your money to try to look for this. I'm not going to this naturium, okay? So I'm not sponsored by 
skills and I'm not sponsored by this one but you can definitely find a lot of better products than this at your local store a lot of other products a lot of other brands have launched it so you can probably see for another vitamin c alascorpic version but if you want the gentler type and you have acne prone skin then you might want to go to this one okay thank you so much for watching see you next time bye